Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's Borzy, and if you are a lover of artists and mouse heads, you're gonna have to take a seat to watch this one. There's no easy way to say it, but as the international spokesperson for artists and mouse heads, I regret to inform you that the Shininkai is being discontinued. And that's right, the artist in Shininkai, this iconic glass coated mouse pad, the only of its kind, is being discontinued, and we have multiple sources to confirm it. We have Cash, which is Agile Cables. Um, I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have heard of him. He is a retailer, a Canadian retailer, and he says it's being discontinued. And I just couldn't believe it. I reached out to my ear in the Japanese streets, Lethal Gaming Gear. I was like, is Artisan really doing this? I couldn't believe it. And he said, yes, they told us back in December. He's been sitting on this news for months. He just knew it would kill the community. Um, but yeah, apparently it's true. Artisan's discontinuing the Shidenkai. And I mean, some of you guys, I'm sure I, my, like my channel, introduced people to Artisan mouse pads. But pre-2020, when you thought of Artisan, you thought of the Shidenkai. So it's just, it's crushing. It's absolutely crushing news. Um, I actually, I have the Shidenkai out right now for the occasion. It's a sick pad. Like, this is with Final Mouse Stock Skates. Just an incredible, incredible mouse pad. God bless it. And I'm sure a lot of people are wondering why would Artisan do such a thing. And while Artisan has obviously not released an official statement, um, we can presume a few factors led to the discontinuation of the Artisan Shidenkai. Um, and my personal opinion is just that they have outgrown it as a company. I don't mean like they're above making Shidenkais. But the Hien, Otsu, and Zero are really fucking popular, and they've already expanded their production capabilities, I think, late 2021. Um, so it makes sense that they just want to get the production down on their most popular pads, as opposed to allocating like a lot of time and resources to a more niche pad. And I think Lethal Gaming Gear said that he thought it had to do with customer support inquiries about the durability. So there's just a lot of factors. Like, it's not really... It's a bit hard to explain, but Artisan used to be a very niche company for like mousepad enthusiasts. Now it's like more of just the standard when you want a high quality mousepad. Um, so just their customer base has changed a bit. It's expanded. So I don't know. I guess they're just moving past the Shinkai. But like I said before, it's absolutely crushing. I would say that it was one of the most unique mousepads on the market. The glass coating just gave it a super light glide, low initial friction. Um, but it was not insanely hard to stop. And with the extra soft version, um, it was just crazy. It was a crazy mouse pad. Um, and it, yeah, sad to see it go. Sad to see it go. Um, everybody put in the comments, hashtag RIP Shidenkai. And then maybe if Artisan sees enough comments, they'll bring it back. Yeah, that's definitely going to work. Um, yeah, I just really wanted to make this video saying that. I looked at the prices on eBay. They don't seem too outrageous. So if you want to like stock up on them, uh, maybe fucking do that. I hope this video doesn't like start price gouging the Shidenkai. But yeah, I um, just wanted to make this news known because people were coming into my stream asking. So I figured might as well say yes, the Arson Shidenkai is being discontinued. Um, like and sub if you enjoyed the video. If you died of shock, I'm really sorry. And yeah, peace.